I'm doing it for my daughter. Call back a different time, not now. For expert NFT service you can count on. Mondo Megabits, your favorite way to spend money. <coughs> I, I know it's hard here. What was that? Are you saying bye? No, no, no. no. Okay. Chris, will you give me a scarf? Yeah. Uh, where are they? Uh, I don't know. I just look around. Probably well, Julian well, hit it because he was cleaning. Julian so, did something with it. Oh, okay. We find it? There's one on your chair. What? There's one on your chair. Is there a chair, chair yeah. scarf? Chris, I have a chair scarf. Edit go. that part out. <laughs> no, just I just need my scarves. <clears throat> Chris, are you getting mad done? Yeah, I did a, Thank God. I did a trailer. Thank God. Um, I know it's hard listening to your own performance, but I think that that is uh, super funny. And it's like um, that th that tape we listened to of the tra tractor trailer semi truck killer. Yes. Where he's like, we didn't actually get the actual tape, but in the actual tape, he's like. You're probably wondering why you're tied up right now. Well, you're in for a bad day. Oh. <laughs> That's what that voice message reminds me of. It's what? like it's, serial killers are like That's the second exposure I've had today to of like seeing a like inside the mind of a serial killer. There was one that was on a game show mm -hmm. and he was a fucking weirdo. And they had the contestants. What, a serial killer? A serial killer was on a dating show in nineteen seventy three. Oh really? And he was like Richard like Arcanaut. Arcanist or something. He had like a fucking nice Bee Gees mullet and shit. But he, and he, you know, he looked like a normal guy. Then he had those like demon eyes. Mm -hmm. You know, those like psychotic, like like eighty percent of criminal eye, yeah, yeah. eye, like oh yeah, yeah, yeah that Al one alligator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Human alligator. Like, yep. Can and we he, look? Can we look this up, Joey? Serial killer on game show. Richard and uh, he was on mm. the game show and he mm -hmm. was being like chipper but off. Uh huh. You know when guys are like uh. You ever meet the guys that are, I, I call them, I remember saying this like a couple weeks ago in the HR department, that this guy, look, he's good looking enough to fuck her, but a will her anyway. Damn. You know what I mean? Damn. That's like the general manager of Lexus that's of War. So like, funny, man. Because that's the truth. Like, you could have fucked her. You're a normal looking guy, but you'll just, you'll touch her pussy while she's sleeping needed instead. needed the rape. Yeah. I think it smells good in here. I love that. Does it? It smells like Abercrombie and Fitch when it just opened up. Like clean. Really? It, smells, it smells nice in here, I'm telling you. It's crazy. I love it. I haven't showered like, in like five days. No, it's... He's got a hard on. <laughs> Find the serial killer. Well, let's see. Baxter number one is a successful photographer who got his start when his father found him in the dark room at the age of 13, fully developed. <laughs> Between takes, he might find him skydiving or motorcycling. Please welcome Rodney Alcala. That guy. That guy had already killed seven women and, and then went on the wow. show. Yeah, yeah. Here she is. Here is a young lady with a wealth of experience. She once earned a living massaging feet, but she quit. Wow. Her boss suggested that she work her way up. Then she taught school in Phoenix, Arizona, and now she's here to educate... Kind of a funny joke. It's heavy, heavy on the innuendo here. Yeah, yeah. She used to rub feet, and then her boss says, work your way up. Her boss said, jerk me off, you fucking pig. Yeah, that's a lot. That's a it is a lot. He's making... He's like, ooh, a kiss. He's sniffing. She's got good gums. Oh, yeah. She's like, I'm here to find a Nice idea. gummy smile. Yeah, oh, yeah. Here to chomp down on something. Jesus. She's like, I have big teeth, but a great cunt. I have a wet, shaven cunt, and it's so cool to have it. Number one. Would you say hello to Cheryl, please? We're going to have a great time together, Cheryl. Okay. And here we go. <laughs> so the guy... Bachelor number one. Yes. What's your best time? The best time is at night. Nighttime. Why do you say that? Because that's the only time there is. The only time? What's wrong with the uh, morning your head. afternoon? <laughs> well, they're okay, but nighttime is when it really gets good. Then you're really ready. I'm a drama teacher, and I'm going to audition each of you for my private class. The oh. Bachelor. Number they were really one. horny back then. Huh? Yeah, this is hornier yeah. than like modern TV. Yeah, yeah. Man, yeah. take it. Oh, come on, over here. Oh, honey, we gotta go out and boogie. What the fuck is going on? She's got fat cans, though. She's falling into the serial killer's net. 
he's he's like uh, playing with her. He's doing um, really good uh, back and forth, a little mind games, a little mind games, a little gaslighting. And then every now and then it just slips out. He's like, I'll take you out to dinner, and we can have some champagne and strawberries, and I can stick an axe in your head. I just, <laughs> what was that last part? You're like, oh, ha 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 ha! I could freeze you. <laughs> Does she pick him? She picks him. She picks him and then doesn't go on a date with him because she creeps him out. He creeps her out. And then the guy, the second bachelor, was they interviewed him. And this guy. <laughs> wow. She's a fucking she's, slut. She's she should. Yeah, she's gonna, she deserves to get fucking stuck with a stabbed in the pussy or whatever the fuck this guy killed the chicks. What's his method? Yeah, I wanted. I think his method was like boring. It was like stabbing. Yeah. Come on, man. Yeah, come on. Microwave him. You know what I mean? He's got those beady little eyes. Yeah, he does. He's got. He's got prisoner eyes. He couldn't. He couldn't think of anything better to do than stab. Yeah, he's a fucking idiot. Dickhead. Yeah. Can you look him up on Wikipedia? Richard. Uh, no, okay, there it is. Rodney. <laughs> Richard. <Alcott>. Richard. <laughs> Oh, he looks like um oh, he's a Leo. It's <laughs> like you. Damn. Looks like Nick Mullen. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Fucking A, man. Yeah, I guess you could kill a lot of people if you wanted to. If you were killing random people, it'd probably be hard as fuck to ever find you. Oh yeah. You'd probably just keep doing it. They're not gonna ever catch you. Yeah. You know what was crazy? When I was little, I always used to think, I used to, I used to watch like the police TV shows and mm -hmm. be like, oh man, you can't do anything. You can't do anything. And um, then I realized like that's, that represents like 2% of like the actual shit. <laughs> like you can just go out, you can go out in the street and like fire a gun randomly. And, and if you drive off, you're probably not going to get caught. Yeah. Like nothing, no one ever gets caught. The people that do get caught, they're bl uh, like blithering morons and they do it they're, they're, they they do it in front of like family members yeah if you ask and there's like a long build up too like I'm going off my pills I'm going nuts man I'm going nuts I'm gonna do something and yeah. then they do it like three days later yeah 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 if you if you talk to a cop and you're like what do you do all day they tell you like the, the they're like I deal with fucking like retards mm -hmm. like everybody's a moron mm -hmm. like a lot of criminals are just like dumb they're very, they're low IQ. Yeah, yeah, it's like it's like the, the scum of life. Like seventy IQ points. Like I threw a full bottle of wine at my wife's head. Mm -hmm. Like everything is domestics around here. Mm -hmm. That's what these guys go do. Mm -hmm. They're just like pulling some Puerto Rican dude off his girlfriend mm -hmm. all day, all day. Just like they have the, the like the the couple separator. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like the jaws of it's, life. It's like a jaws of life. It's just come. <laughs> it's just another Puerto Rican kid with like a t like a t like a hat on. Yeah, like a Toronto maple with a, a fuckboy haircut. <laughs> yo yo chill yo 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 chill yo 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 chill yo chill chill. And you have to like put their names in. Yeah, like <laughs> you have to scan their IDs. Like yo Benny chill man Benny chill man yo 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 Damn. yo yo. And she's just flipping out like cat scratching him. That's an awesome. Bit. Yo get off me yo yo yo. It's a robot. It's a robot ghetto. Dominican guy Damn. that walks into the domestics. <laughs> That's <laughs> and a he's, super funny. He's bit. a narc cop. He's he, not a person though. He's like no, a robot. Right. He's looking like Ali G, but he's like a Dominican guy. <laughs> and it's got to scan the people's names for it to work. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. What's like a common S Spanish dude's name? Julio. Julio, chill, yo, 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 chill, yo, dude. Hey, Bobby, sit down, man. Take it easy, man. Damn. Take a walk, man. You need to have a smoke. You're like, you need to chill, bro. You need to chill. It's just a robot. Mm -hmm. It goes up. It gets caught on stairs and shit. Like, yo, these fucking stairs, yo. <coughs> oh, damn. <laughs> it's got colloquialism. <laughs> it's got like a, yo, it's fucking, this, this apartment's fat. He throws in little... <laughs> Keeps the situation cool. Yo, is that your car outside? That's just fucking clean. <laughs> yo, chill, yo. Damn, that's like a world peace too bit right there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, 